What's going on guys and welcome to Sons of the Forest, a game I'm loving right now and a game you guys are enjoying as well. It's what everybody's playing right now, it's the, it's the hype, it's such a good game, a very well built world, but it's got a lot of flaws and yes, Kelvin is one of them. Kelvin is one of my favourite characters, we have a special bromance, you can give him some commands, you can get him to follow you, you can get sticks, items, rocks, or even fish if you next are at a fish source, either a pond or a stream or something like that. But he also has his disadvantages as well. Like, if you tell him to finish the structure that you placed within a treehouse, for example, he will grab the logs off the floor and start building it. But as you know, when he runs out of logs to pick up, he will break down the treehouse you're making by chopping down the tree. Yep. <laughs> and that's our beloved Kelvin. Even though he does it, you've got to love him. But then I was thinking... I had a dream, I had an epiphany, and I was like, I wonder what it would like if I had five Kelvins, for example. And then, just like that, I have multiple Kelvins. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and I can give them all commands, but the thing is as well, is I'm gonna go around each and every single one of them, I'm gonna tell this one to get logs. And I want him to drop on them right here. And then I'm gonna have to get this one, to do exactly the same and this one and this one and this one and yes and this one so technically i've got six not five okay and there we have it my little minions are at work they're all trying to place the logs in this area trying to chop the same tree <laughs> and try to grab the same logs <laughs> all to put it back in this pile but i tell you what it's so much quicker. But then I wanted more. I needed more power. So I got more Kelvins. <laughs> so men, listen up. You are my next battalion of workers. I want you to go out there. I want you to get as much trees as possible. And then bring them back here. Are you with me? Sir, yes sir! So after many orders later, <laughs> my next workforce are out grabbing their logs. We have one just chilling. About seven chopping the same tree. I -o, I -o, I -o. It's off to work we go. With a bucket and a spade and a hand grenade. <laughs> oh, that's all I can think about. That's all I'm humming every time I'm just going through this. This is absolutely hilarious. The only thing you've got to watch out for, though, is the multiple trees that are dropping down every now and again. And it's, it's kind of like a real life version of Kaplunk, you know? Like every now and again, I'll look over to the right or something, there's a tree coming towards me, I'm gonna dodge it. I love how they play follow the leader. They kind of just follow one, watch. One of them will run off here. Look, they all start following each other again. Like, I want that log, no. Okay, I wanna go get to this tree. No, I want this log. No, okay, let's divert, pivot, go to this tree. <laughs> And then it's cursed because there's faces within faces and they all pull out the hatchets at the same time. <laughs> but remember, if you're enjoying this video, to give it a big thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed, subscribe. You might want to check out my other content right here. God damn it, Calvin. Okay, so as you can see, I'm having a lot of issues right now because I've spawned in over a thousand... Kelvins. <laughs> and every time they move, it causes massive frame drops. And you can even see the shadows, and that's even running with a 4090 and a 7950X Ryzen 9. And this is struggling so hard. It's starting to smooth out a little bit, but it's when they start moving as a unit and there's so much logic that the game has to try and cope with. <laughs> okay, so I've been on this screen now for like five to ten minutes. And what makes it terrifying is if you look at the front row and then you just work your way back, it starts getting more creepier and creepier and creepier because they're just trying to peek around the other Kelvin's head to look at me. And there we have it. The game is officially not responding and has crashed. I've officially broke Sons <laughs> of the Forest with 1,000 and plus. I 
wonder. What do you think, Calvin? Okay, let's do it. You're right there, Calvin. <laughs> okay, so things got a little bit out of hand and I found out is I can add a lot more Virginias than what I can with Kelvin. I've added over 10,000. My fingers are aching. I've been doing it for like half an hour, just spamming and bringing them in. But oh boy, is this low-key terrifying. They randomly start dancing. And they just randomly try to walk up to me and try try to like gain their trust. My FPS is not as bad as what Kelvin is. But I think it's because he follows you. Either that or it's the light on his chest or something. But it looks like a zombie horde. I'm not going to lie to you. They're literally everywhere. They keep going over that rock. There's a lot of them just drinking water. But what I'm super curious about is because I've got these in here now, if I was to go to the opposite side of the map, would all of these track me down to try and earn their trust? I'm curious. I'm actually really curious. Because that'd be low-key terrifying, right? Imagine if I'm just kind of building a base, and next thing you know, you just look out into the trees and you see about 100 of these coming through. Even worse than that, a 1,000. Just kind of coming through, dropping blueberries at your feet. But then again, imagine them all with a pistol and a shotgun in their hand. Oh my god, imagine. That would be for sure, that would for sure take time. The other thing is as well, is they move like sheep, right? Look, they're all just running away from me. It's like an episode of Baywatch right now. And I'm David Hasselhoff. <laughs> okay, so my frames are back to normal now, but that's because a lot of these are actually... I wouldn't say despawning. If I move along here, I think they're going to come... They're going to start popping back in again. You can slowly see them coming back in, but it's like an army of Virginias. I'm curious, I'm wondering, what would happen if I was to bring in some more Kelvins at the same time now? Okay, so I brought in over 50, 50 Kelvins, and it seems to be running fine for now, but not all of them are moving. It does feel like an episode of The Matrix. Well, a movie of The Matrix, because they're all following me. Where are all these going? Oh my god, Kelvins assemble. They're making their way here. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with his shadow over there. The game is literally freaking out right now. So guys, we're going to actually leave this video right here. So thank you so much for watching. Uh, check out my other content right here. You might be interested in it. You've got some playlists. you got another video that's to your liking. And also like, subscribe, and also leave a comment. Even if it's just an emoji, uh, it's what we do on this channel. Uh, and without further ado, I'll see you in another video. And as always, keep smiling. Subscribe. Subscribe, or I'll eat your soul. <laughs>